Hey guys, welcome to part three of the magic run. Done a little bit of work, uh, nothing too game changing. So I've um, upgraded my uh, bow straight sword to magic, got that up to plus five, so I grinded the green uh, stones required for that. Also, while I was there, because we're going to go deep and dark soon, I got the blue titanic chunk. We're about to go into the gardens. I also got the 20,000 souls for the key of uh, Crest of Atorius, so we can go into that area. So pretty much we're ready to explore this whole area now. We're going to fight a butterfly and a dog, because we're a big tough man and that's what we do. And then we're going to go upgrade to Enchanted, and then we're going to look in to Blight Town, which I'm really not looking forward to, so let's just crack on with it. So let's do, I think this is Butterfly first. So that was fun, yeah, getting the upgrade materials for the blue for the Nightmare. I've done a little bit in this area, but not most of it. <laughs> so yeah, I'll try to leave myself. I've got the elite right, armor as you can see, if I'm wearing it. I'm pretty much left the rest of the area. As you would normally find it. I was using that room in there to get some souls for the Crest of the Taurus. Oh, we like that. I can definitely live with one shot in those guns. There's not a lot in here from what I remember. There's another tree in the way. Somewhere. area. I honestly can't remember it very well. This is not great for your viewing pleasure if I wander around aimlessly. Hey, yeah, it is what it is. Let's get off here. I think there's a few items around here. There's nothing game changing. And the boy, he's just chilling next to me. Hello, buddy. I really hate that. <laughs> I really hate that. <laughs> so this is the item you couldn't see on the other side earlier. Wolf ring. Look forward to never equipping it. But <laughs> The problem is I can remember where things are hidden, but I can't remember what exactly is hidden there. So, it's nice to have a little refresher. Whoa! I really want these guys to drop me their armour, that'd be amazing. A load of frog things flying up now. One, two, and three. Drop myself. I think that's down to the Hydra. Should be a ladder over here or something. Right. Four. <laughs> I'll be very up Ooh, hello. <laughs> I'll be very upset when I'm an out of solo. It's not happening anytime soon now, so I think I'll be able to clear the area. I think I have to clear the area, to be honest. 
I think that pillar over there is just holding up where the boss is. From memory. Put it underneath where the butterfly is. Yeah, so that's that bit done. <laughs> Only thing left to do now would be to go and fight the boss. In this area there's a load of these giant things. I'm just gonna ignore them, I can one shot them, I'm not that worried about them. They do go 600 tiles a pop, but I've got the item from around the corner there. This guy is going to wake up. My favourite thing to do is to farm these guys with a eye hander. <laughs> Stun lock them and I'll one shot them when you get that far. Okay, so we've got great soul arrow. I've never fought this thing with a range spell before. It's always flying around and annoying the hell out of me. So I think I'm gonna really enjoy this. Oh, I'm about to fly, where are you? Hello. Uh, not if I miss it. Ooh, okay. I don't get too overconfident. for a landing. Really? <laughs> and that's why we brought the stick along. <laughs> Just fancy smacking the butterfly around the head. <laughs> this is essentially my next run I'm planning on doing is for a safe run through. And the problem with that is you don't get any five weapons until you get to here, I believe. So you have to kill this boss without any physical weapon. Which is fine, but you also don't start with an offensive spell. So I'm working on a way of probably just going kind to of jump the first level. And then get to the bottom. Oh god. <laughs> so that's really don't pay attention in Dark Souls people. Yeah, so we're gonna go back and get those 20,000 souls. It won't take long. Use a hang my bone to get back, I promise. So yeah, my plan is to jump the first bit because you can't beat the Taurus demon about a physical attack unless you get lucky and he jumps off and then once you've beaten the tourist team and there's a slant right behind me you can then uh, well, once you've got past the tourist team you can go join the covenant of sunlight you will need to reach level 25 so God damn it. <laughs> I'll work it out. I will have to allow myself to beat the um, first boss in the little um, dungeon area of the club. That was um, just stuck. Where did I fall from? Oh my god. I wonder if I died. There we go. Okay. Now all that messing it. Whoa. <gasps> now that messing around. So that's the one buff soul which is useful to me. Because it gives an intelligence weapon. 
Take another cut, isn't it? I like round numbers, that's going up. I do like round numbers. Gotta take out the 15. And I'll take the achievement up to get five slots. And then we go mental. Okay, so stage one complete. Stage two. There was loads of NPC guys. Yeah. And they're really annoying. So I might just leg it past them, to be honest. So I'm here for two things. That's Sif and the Ember. There he is. Little invisible fella. Come on. Come on. I'll see you. I'll see you. Yeah, that's going to be a problem. Yeah, we're legging it. We are legging it. <laughs> oh, maybe now is not the time. We're going that way, I'm going this way. Oh god. <laughs> I'll be about to speak to you in a minute. Could you just stop your friends from attacking me? That would be wonderful. I'm very aware I'm one shot away from being killed here. Okay. So, first things first, the Ember. Just gonna ignore these guys, they pack one hell of a punch. I'm not in the mood to get beaten up by mushrooms and I've run all that way. Come on. I'll need you over here. You can come and play as well. Got a quick look over it. There's some majorly tough cats around here somewhere. I remember them in my last playthrough. And I don't want to mess with them. <laughs> Maybe at the end of the game I'll come back and just one shot them. But at the moment, nah. <laughs> oh, I left all your children alone. There's a cat, there's a cat, there's a cat. We don't like cats. I want that item, but I don't like cats. Item wasn't worth it. Okay, let's go and put a dog down. I feel bad. If anyone knows the story of the Iron Stiff, then I hate this fight. What I like to do in here is get the Hornet Ring before I do the fight, otherwise I forget. Just run around to the back. Get that. And just pop through here. And sadness. Alright, so calm down, calm down. Oh my god. <laughs> he does not stay still this dog. Let's 
Got to keep damage on him. Oh, not letting him damage us. Keep a distance. He gets slower as the fight goes on, so that's a good thing. I can get bleed damage on him. That level. Remember that attack when I first fought him ended me so many times. Where are you? Hello. Get <laughs> really close to. gets a bit frantic now, which is dangerous. But it will slowly start slowing down. It's too slow, we're gonna have to slow it down the slow line. If you get stuck on that second hit, you're dead. Cheers, sir. Whoa! Bad boy. Bad boy. Bad boy. That'd be... I'm happy you're doing that. There we go. Oh no! <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> I don't want to do it. No. <laughs> anyway. Oh, he's gone. Oh, so sad. Forty thousand souls for that. Really good lad. Such a good boy. He's protecting his master. He's protecting us, being fair. Master would have been. Let's get some levels going. Start the 15, at the 17. A little bit to go. I can't remember what achievement I need to get to. Let's just use these, why not? I need to unhollow myself as well. That's a reward for getting past the cats. <laughs> Sneak in the back way. <laughs> That's enough two more levels. Or not. <laughs> wow. <laughs> oh, come on. Need a bit of money anyway for um, my upgrades. So now we have Enchanted Ember, we're going to go all the way back to New Londo. See our buddy in the little cave in there. What? Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, the enemy's upgraded or something. Really? This one that one shot, so. I haven't needed to upgrade my magic for a long time. It's going to be Sense Fortress as the big damage dealing jump. Uh oh. I wanted that. <laughs> Where um, all of a sudden the enemies take a lot more hits and deal a lot more damage. As I found in one of my no-left runs, I got the Sense Fortress and just got two shots. 
Right, the two snake people right at the start. That was a fun way to end. I thought I was quite powerful. Right, we're nearly there. Oh, can't wait until they get fast travel. I can't remember who I'll give the provider number to. Is it Andre? Yes, it is. So now you can turn things divine for me. Not that. I care. So I'm not going to be using them. The um, skeletons in the catacombs. If you kill the guy, you keep summoning them, they die. So you don't need a divine weapon to get through that area. Where my divine run now would be very interesting. Gonna have to impose a similar rule to this on divine. I don't just make myself a nice divine as a right hander at the start. Bonk everything to death. The divine's right hander in one hand and the wrath of god in the other. Does sound quite appealing. But once you get it, I might actually go to. Oh, let's do that. Let's go to the Undead Asylum before we go to Light Town. Because I don't want to do Light Town. Light Town's horrible. <laughs> I might do Light Town off stream. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> it's that bad. What have you got to say? I would love to have 20,000 souls and buy that ring that increases the sort of series by 20%. But I do not have 20,000 souls spare at the moment. And I'll tell you what, no. between the next videos I'll grind that ring out. Give me something to do. I'm sure I'll think of something that needs doing. Did I send the lift back? Yeah, I'm a good boy. <laughs> there I am, there's my nose. I had to swap the piggy head for the gargoyle head because that's the only way the armor was going to work. Here we go. Hello, my friend. Is that? Yeah, it is. <laughs> I've never seen one like that. Not even back in Vinheim. What a brilliant flame. Please, friend, let me have that. I am begging you. I am a craftsman of Vinheim. I'd go hollow before I pass a flame on the Thank God, hollow. The one merchant I need. You are wonderful. I will forge a wicked masterpiece just for you. A weapon to make a legend out of. We're going to do that right now. Enemy. See, the stats are similar. A little bit more in the Baldur's Five Sword. But the bleed 300 on some of the late game bosses, that's going to be much more worth it. So we'll go for that. And then. Just a little bit of reinforcement going down. And then I need a slab. I'm not farming another eight blue chunks anytime soon to do anything else. So we've got A scaling and intel now. We should be doing a lot more damage with that sword. Keep your head on. See you later, buddy. I'll find a slab. Uh, so, we were going to do the Undead Asylum next. Just for fun. Hopefully I'll be able to beat that Asylum Dean. He is... Oh, do you know what? <laughs> I'm not sure on these. 
I would love to take my face up to 18 and just homeward everything, but I need the magic space. Anyway. So I think we need to get a key first, and then when we're here, we need to... Wrong way. We need to get a doll. Is he there? No, he's here. Oh, hello. Well, nice. So he can give you two more attacking spells. Right. Goodbye. Then. I think it's when um, Big Out Logan arrives. He gets a few more spells. So we won't worry about that for a little while yet. We're messing around too much. I don't know how this is going to go in here. I can't remember what level everything is. I'm also mid rolling, which is not ideal. That's the job done. Hello, Mr. Crow. You're going to take me on an adventure. That's the key. That just takes you down to where that woman is. <laughs> okay, so up we go up these stairs. Come on. No falling off, please. I don't think there's anything down here. No, as all I am, is still chilling down there. Curl up like a ball. <sighs> there we go. There's some content. Just waiting as a ball. <laughs> don't get too excited. I want to try my new sword out and see what damage it does. What this does do is unlocks the crows though for exchanging. I don't know if there's anything I'd want to exchange for. Yeah. But. Wow. Wow. Don't die to these guys. Oh my god. That's <laughs> shame. Why, why did I not just hit them with magic? <laughs> okay, so back we go. Oh. He's got the key this time. Oh, is that about? Never happened. <laughs> Don't know what happened to that spell. I panicked and I saw the scene in the guy's fire car. Reckon the crow will be a bit faster this time. Yeah. <laughs> okay, take two. Ignore that big green puddle of my old self. This is how we should have done it the first time. There we go. Alright, so we're going to not go in the middle of the floor just yet. Spoiler alert, something's going to happen there. So we're just going to quickly rest here. And then let's see what, how we do against this boss. I like the fact that you get instant fall damage. Ready? Whoa! Forgot he does that. Over and over again. 
Wow. But I don't think I ever got to my feet in that. Let's try that again. This time without the constant dying. Yeah, there's a reason I didn't kill my hollow. <laughs> Really? <laughs> My soul should be a bit more approachable now. This might be difficult. What I need to do is get behind him from memory. That's perfect. Not that way. Just focus on the big boy. How did that miss? Stick on that bum. That good old jiggly bum. Oh. So on. Just gotta be patient. Take up time. That's bad. That's really bad. Pretty sure I rolled that. Close. <laughs> uh, back in our play. Get a sneaky shot. Eh? He can cut this guy's tail off, I believe. Might get that guy. The tail off. No. <laughs> oh, I'm saying behind you, son. I'm saying behind you. Ooh, it was a bit closer. That was a bit close. We got him. Oh god. <laughs> uh, this is bad. This is really bad. Just about got away with that. And what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? The bleed down is not for sure. <laughs> there it goes. And that. And that. That's him. That's him done.
Nice. That was intense. We've got a black knight up ahead. And I'm worried. <laughs> Pretty much, I'm very concerned that I do not have the powers to beat him right now. Two black knights, actually. Is that so? That's the area. <laughs> Let's try it and see what happens. We can always do. So he's not going to follow me now. Oh, maybe he is. Oh, thank God he didn't. <laughs> Come on. Can Black Knights climb ladders? <laughs> I'll get to fight him on her. I don't want to fight him. He's stuck. <laughs> Here he comes. Yeah, that hurt. That really hurt. The real reason for coming here is actually this. Oh wow! I'll cheese him. <laughs> oh, I happily cheese him. I get his sword. <laughs> um, what? <laughs> this was unexpected. Just because I hit you at the beginning of the game. I mean, seriously, man. <laughs> no need to be like this. It's twice I've killed you in one game. This time you cheated. <laughs> Give me that. <laughs> I would love my Estus to get randomly refilled now. Up these stairs, that's what triggered it. And we're laughing. He's still a bit mad. I killed him last time I saw him. What am I doing? <laughs> you know you can't be trusted with souls. <laughs> there we go, so that's achievement. And I've got five slots now. There we go. Happy days.
that you came all the way from here just to annoy me up here oh, that, that got me that genuinely got me forgot all these lads today <laughs> He's a better one. Up here, we've got another Black Knight, I believe. I'm not kindling that bonfire, I refuse. Yeah, the key I got was for this door. There's two, you know. <laughs> just one extra spell I have used. There we go. Now, around down here, there's a black knight with a halberd. I want to say. Oh no, it's just the item that I completely missed. something chasing me. I swear there's two black knights in. Oh, I missed. Probably running around chasing me. I wasn't, haven't looked in the right direction. Yet. Oh, there. No, I'm just going to magic them. Alright, this time we're at the oops. Go away. That's the one that lets you move through the swamp. I'm glad I got that. So, I think we have finished with the Undead Asylum, sadly. <laughs> Only excuse I could find not to go to Blight Town. In here. So I'm just determined to find. There it is. Need this too. <laughs> oh really? Wow. <laughs> Run away! Where have you come from? <laughs> Do not fall down the hole. <laughs> oh, really? Is that where they came from? Him for him, then the hell is it for There we go, never one done. Two Black Knight Swords. Stop it. Okay. So all that's left now is return. And then get ourselves down to Blight Town, which I'm going to do in another video. So I think this is a nice place to leave it. Go up like a ball. Thanks for watching guys. See you next time.